Hello, welcome to today's video. Today I thought it would be fun if I showed you how I take my Instagram pictures, how I get myself ready, because you know right now, I'm cute, but like I'm not Instagram ready, you know? So um, we have to change my whole appearance basically because Instagram is fake and we don't wanna show any realness whatsoever. So I wanted to show you guys basically how I get ready to take pictures and then how I take them. So me and Brandon, since we got a new camera, we wanna go basically have a photo shoot and just go wild and get some really good Instagram pictures because that's all that matters nowadays it's 2018 all that matters is instagram so nothing else nothing else at all so i'm gonna transform myself into an instagram worthy human being and then i'm gonna show you how i basically take my instagram pictures because a lot of people ask me how i do it i feel like youtube me and instagram me are two completely different people youtube me is like does not care how she looks whatsoever obviously she's super chill you know she just doesn't care but instagram me always looks good she's just always killing it so we need to turn youtube me into instagram me <laughs> first thing first can't be showing that i have any imperfections can't show that i'm basically blind so we have to get rid of these and um to do that i have contacts of course because i wear them show you like me washing my face and stuff. Oh, I actually do need to wash my face. <sighs> it's probably fine. I'm just not gonna wash my face. <laughs> Anyways, let's get started with the makeup. All right, for makeup, this is basically where the biggest part of the transformation takes place. First things first. Concealer, gotta hide the fact that I only had like four nightmares last night and woke up several times throughout the night. <laughs> I used heart shape tape. Um, Oh, is this, this is the wrong shade. Fuck. Well, I guess I gotta use it now because I don't have anything to wipe it off my face with, so. Should I like zoom in? I don't know how to zoom in. That is not it. I can, ouch. Oh, there we go. Oh my God, look at her. Look at her go. Oh my God, my concealer is gonna dry. Oh wow, look at that setup queen. Okay, now we blend. Sorry that the lighting's kind of bad. I suck at everything, so. Yeah, oh, I definitely, definitely should have washed my face. Um, this looks really bad. I 100% should have washed my face, but who doesn't love a good, oh my God, I'm not even in the frame. <laughs> you see that, you see that difference? Yeah, that's what you want. That's what you're going for. Okay, looking good, looking good. Next, we have to set, we have to set this. So, sorry if, I looking, if I'm looking to the side. The viewfinder's on the side, so yeah, I'm gonna look at myself. What do you expect? I am a human being after all. I use powder foundation most of the time because I just, I'm honestly too lazy to put on liquid foundation. I'm really getting progressively more and more lazy as the days go by. <laughs> but I did go to the gym the other night for the first time in like a year. I know, I know, we're all shocked, but my legs are so sore that I can barely walk. So won't be doing that again <laughs> anytime soon. Next is contour, you guessed it. I'm so sick of doing my makeup, honestly. Why can't I just wake up looking good? Blush is my favorite part because it makes it look like I have been going out in the sun when Y'all know I have it. I like a lot of blush. I like to be a rosy girl. So, what's up? How you doing? Me? I'm doing pretty okay. Yesterday was a little bit rough for me, but today's a new day and I'm feeling a lot better than I did yesterday. I like to put blush on my nose because it makes me look like Rudolph the red Nose f***ing reindeer. And who doesn't love Rudolph? Oh wow, it really looks like I just went out into the cold for like five years. Okay, I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't really get pimples all that much. I've had fairly clear skin most of my life. And so when I get a pimple, it's like super noticeable for me because I don't really get them that much. But the other day, usually I can deal with that. I'm like, I don't care. Like, oh, it's cute. It's a little pimple, whatever. I'm not gonna be like one of those bitches that with clear skin that complains about having like two pimples and it's like, oh my God, I'm breaking out. But the other day I got a pimple right here. You can. You can kind of see her. It was the most painful thing I've ever experienced. That's a lie. I've experienced so many painful things, but it was pretty damn painful. Like I literally couldn't open my mouth past this. I was trying to eat a salad and I was like, I didn't literally stuff it into my mouth. I'm not complaining, but like I fucking hated it. Oh no, but now it's like not going away. So it's fine. It just looks like a little herpes, but who doesn't have a little touch of herpes? <laughs> Lots of people, I hope. It feels really weird doing my makeup in like a completely empty room. I'm used to like my mom's room, which is so cluttered and messy all the time. No offense, mom. Did you make sure it's still recording? Yes. 
leave me alone. Next is highlighter, and that's my favorite step because it makes me look amazing. <laughs> now, if you're gonna try to take a good Instagram picture, my number one tip is to go when the sun is setting. Not when the sun is like right about to set. You gotta get it at like the perfect window of time and it just does something magical. Like it makes my eyes look bluer, makes my skin look clear and smooth. It makes my highlight look like pop in, which is why highlight is such an important step. So you really want to pack on that highlighter because today we're going for a golden hour picture. You want to hear something funny? I bought this palette for $45. Yeah, 45. You heard that right. Honestly, you don't know. You want to know why? Because of this. Because it looks cool. This palette, no offense, but it sucks. <laughs> it is just like chunky glitter on my face and I hate it. So it was a waste. Don't buy this palette. And if you have it and you like it, that's really questionable. I'm gonna use it anyways because I don't like to waste my money. So even if I buy something and I completely hate it, I will still use it. And I know what you're thinking, why didn't you return it? Because then I would have to go back to the store. Hate that for me. It's just a highlighter palette. There's worse things going on in the world than that. We all know that, Jesus Christ. I don't think I'll be dyeing my hair back to black anytime soon. So if you're one of those people that's like, dye your hair back black, no. <laughs> And also, F you. My eyebrows are absolutely atrocious, honestly. The lighting is so dark, I hate that. <gasps> you guys, I'm so excited, I'm going home. On Tuesday, it's Saturday. I'm literally so excited. I know I've only been here for like two and a half weeks, but yeah, my eyebrows don't look good at all. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going home and I'm so excited because Thanksgiving is my favorite holiday. I love eating Thanksgiving food and I love being around my family and I also I'm so excited. My friends are coming home from college. I'm so excited to hang out with them, especially my best friend Emily if you're watching this I miss my cat so much. It's not even funny Like I can deal with missing my mom and my sister and my dad and everyone. I cannot deal with missing my cat like it's <laughs> It's been rough. So yeah, going home in a few days. I'm really excited and mostly excited to just not feel lonely because I have felt so lonely these past two and a half weeks. Honestly, that's all I'm gonna do with my eyebrows because they just look bad no matter what I do. I don't care. You shouldn't care either. 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 I'm, wor I'm working on my British accent. Oh God, you guys, I wish I was British so bad. I wish I was British. Every time I hear a British accent, it seriously affects me. It doesn't matter what your face looks like. If you have a British accent, <laughs> it just affects me. You could be the worst person in the world and have a British accent. You could be hit. Okay, I'm not gonna get into that. <laughs> That's too far. Okay, next eyeshadow. I use of these two shades, pink and brown. And I mix them and I put it on my eye. It's pretty cool, pretty crazy. You've never seen it before. Ew, this camera is so clear. I don't like it. So we're just gonna put that in the crease and on the lid, ladies. Crease and lid, ladies, crease and lid. So I just wanna say, I'm sorry I haven't been posting as many videos lately. I've just been busy um, missing my cat, honestly. <laughs> I'm not gonna get into my emotional state right now, but you just should know it's been a little up and down. We're not gonna get into that because this is a happy video. I really like the smoky look. Um, that's what I go for. Smoky and sultry and sexy. <laughs> That's me, described in three words. You see that difference? Yeah, you're probably like, I like this eye better. I don't care, because it's gonna look good. It's gonna look good and it's gonna look great. Floating around in ecstasy, so don't stop me now. Ow, I fucking fucked myself. I never do that, oh my god. I'm losing my touch. I'm losing myself as a person because I moved to Florida and I'm changing. Next, mascara. I get so many questions about my mascara choice. This is what I use. Brand new one, brand spanking new. I actually don't like using it when it's like first open because it's too wet, it's too wet. I need it to be a little more dry. I just pack this shit on. I go over top of the lashes, I go underneath the lashes, I go from the side, I go like every freaking where. So this is gonna take so many coats since this is new, so let's just skip. Skip it.
Wow, look at that difference though. Okay, now it's time for lips, which is my favorite part because it adds the most dramatic effect. As you can see, I have pretty small lips, which is fine, which is why I like to overline them a lot. <laughs> oh, well, I fucked up. I fucked it up. <laughs> is that oh my god i'm doing such a bad job because i'm rushing i fucked it up okay that's the best we're gonna get <laughs> lip gloss changes everything you see that lip injections who all right now we have to do my hair Fuck. got the tools since my hair is bleached and damaged i have not been washing it for like four or five days at a time it's pretty gross but honestly i'm loving it because you know how lazy i am so dry shampoo this is the dry shampoo i use it smells delicious i literally got it like a few days ago so just do <coughs> i just do a little bit of that literally makes it smell like i washed my hair which i didn't okay now that my hair is kind of volumized and cute <laughs> i mean I'm gonna try to do something new today. I've never done this before. Oh my god, this guy's dog ate a flower and he's trying to get it out of its mouth. I love experimenting with new hairstyles and other things. Oh my god, do you guys see the variation of pink in my hair? It's just like 10 different colors, but it's fine. It's fine, she's cute. I mean, she's kind of cute. Now we're gonna curl it. This is so fun. I'm so hungry too. There's so much to do when the sun is setting. Aww. I always like to experiment with new hairstyles to like switch up my Instagram, keep things interesting. You know, you don't want every picture to look exactly the same and all I post is pretty much pictures of myself. So some would say I'm self-absorbed, but I just say, mm, yeah, a little. <laughs> you can be insecure and self-absorbed at the same time. Okay, it's kind of a mess, but it's fine, it's fine. Now that we have the hair and makeup done, we need to do the outfit, bitch. Coincidentally, I just ordered a shirt from Urban that is pink because I've been feeling pink lately, if you can't tell already. Don't watch me. <laughs> Did you really think I was gonna change on camera? Just because I took a bath on camera doesn't mean I get naked on camera. And we are changed. Like I said, the shirt is from Urban. It says another planet because I'm a fucking alien bitch. And then these shorts are from Princess Polly. So this is the final finished look. I have officially transformed into Instagram Kennedy. Um, YouTube Kennedy is gone. She's dead. I killed her. She's still in that room. So yeah, um, cameraman, will you please pan down on my outfit? to eat real quick, fuel up, and then go catch the last bit of sunlight, take some photos, and then post them to Instagram so that people think we're doing better than we actually are. But we're really Ooh. super sad because we miss our cat and our mom. Kind of turn it off. Like her. I said turn it off. Why, <laughs> turn it off. why is it you and Claudia is not going? Yikes. Someone help her. Um, I filmed the next part, but I didn't turn the microphone on, which is not something I'm used to. New camera. So I'm just going to explain to you what happened next because I can't use that footage. Basically, we got in the car and we were trying to think of places to go. We decided to go to the roof of our apartment building garage, parking garage. And so that's where we ended up. And then I just basically set up a time lapse. So you guys can see like how I post for pictures. I don't know how the process of taking the photos. So let's just, let's just cue that time lapse right now. We just finished taking pictures as you can see we're still on the roof obviously we haven't moved but i'm just going to film my outro here because the lighting makes me look better than i actually do so i will pick some pictures out of out of those that i like and edit them and i'll show them now
So that's pretty much what I do when I want to take Instagram pictures. Usually it's selfies and I do it myself, but every once in a while when I'm feeling frisky, me and Brandon will have a photo shoot. Gotta keep up the Instagram game. Are you zooming in? Anyways, guys, that's all. <laughs> that was good, right? Do a cartwheel. That was pathetic. How about this? Is that your Irish jig? <laughs> so exhausting. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for watching. Hope this gave you some insightful tips on how to be a better Instagrammer and how to make it look like you're obsessed with yourself when you're really super insecure. Yeah, I learned so much today. Love you guys so much. Mwah! See you in my next video. And that's pretty much it. <laughs> Three, so. two, one. Bye. Can I zoom now? I'm zooming. I'm still zooming. <laughs>